Hey y'all, what's up? It's Mimi Quarantina and we're doing another story time today about how my boyfriend Bakari smashed my phone. Show him the phone. Blow up. So, yes, this is what the phone looks like at the moment. And no, I... Okay, so basically what happened was this day, we was like, we was chilling or whatever in my mom's room. We was chilling on the bed and he was like on his phone, I was on my phone, but we was like right next to each other. And I'm looking at my phone and I'm like looking at my DMs and I said something about my ex. Um, something about my ex DMing me. I'm like, why is he DMing me? But I said out loud. And then, to be honest with y'all, I don't even remember what exactly it was that got him pissed. But I told him and I, I guess he got annoyed. And then like we started arguing about like guys in my dms something like that but mind y'all like i'm not like that like i'm not a cheater and you know like he he was just he was mad for some reason i forgot it was something and so i guess it was like why you i don't know i forgot i don't want to put words in his mouth that he didn't say make him look bad i want to do that so i don't remember but i remember that and then um so it, it had something to do with like guys in my dm or whatever but then basically we started going back and forth and the thing i get really annoyed about is every time we argue like like he wants to go away from me and you know i know it's good to like get y'all space but i'm i'm crazy like i don't want him to be away from me even when we arguing so he like i guess like i i was the one that left the room and because he was saying some bs and that got me mad and so we're both mad and shit like that um, it escalates and then I ended up calling him out his name and called him with one word he hates the most and that's a pussy so I literally got up acted like I was walking out the door like leaving the room I halfway closed the door opened it back up real quick and I was like pussy and then I closed the door he got so mad like literally he was like what you said and then he stood up really fast and started like charging towards me and shit so then I'm in the living room and I sit down. My biggest mistake had this phone in my hand. I'm on it. And then he's like, he we're yelling at each other. He snatches my phone out of my hand, goes out to the balcony and hangs it over the damn balcony and threatens to drop it if I didn't apologize to him. And I told him, bro, I'm not apologizing. I'm not apologizing. So he was like, all right. And he breathing real heavy. He getting really mad. And then basically we take the argument back inside and mind you my mom was cooking in the kitchen like but she was she was minding her business she didn't really want to get into it so then all of a sudden one once again he threatens to smash my phone and then like he has the phone like this like and like he getting mad and stuff and then like all of a sudden the world stops as soon as he smashes it he literally was he went to the kitchen floor to do this i just love this part and go like boom and it smashes like all over the damn floor as you can see it bent and everything like just whatever right that happened i'm crying i'm getting upset he goes away from me i'm in the bathroom like screaming crying oh no before that i go up to him i like i was following him into the room and then I look him in his eyes and I'm like crying and shit. I'm furious, bro. I smack him in the face. Boom. Like that. I don't know how hard I smacked him, to be honest. I don't think I did smack him that hard. But I smacked him. And, you know, I'm just really upset at this point. And he doesn't want to put his hands on me. So then he ends up picking me up and, like, slamming me on the bed. And, like, my... my hey, guys. Sorry about that. Got a call. But anyway, so, yeah. My legs were wrapped around him. And then he just, you know, got back up and then walked away. Storms off. I'm like, yo, I'm so f mad. Next thing I do when he's talking and apologizing to my mom, because I told him, I said, my mom, I didn't buy that. My mom had that, and then she gave it to me because she got the iPhone X and gave it to me. He's out there apologizing to her in the um, balcony or whatever. Meanwhile, I'm looking in his bag for something to fuck up because you didn't think that you was going to get away with that. With that. With, you didn't think that you was going to get away with that without me doing something bad. Like, come on. So I took his CD, his favorite little Call of Duty game that, you know, y'all guys just love to play. And I scratched that shit up. And I, because I'm petty, I put I love you in scratches on the CD because, yes, I'm crazy like that, okay? I go in the bathroom. I'm on the ground. My mom starts talking to me. I start crying. I'm like, <laughs> I'm, I'm just upset at this point. But, yeah, so that's what happened, you guys, okay? 
to this day he still owes me a phone i love that man and he's a good person but he did me dirty that day don't have your phone in your hand okay lesson don't have your phone in your hand while in an argument with your boyfriend Period. Thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl Mimi Quarantina and Mimi Quarantina Vlogs. Love y'all so much.